is such an enlightening day, we invite you all to go to our final moment, Healing Through Prayer. We will utilize the practice of visualization, uniting our thoughts as the engine to help us connect with the superior spirituality. How do we do that? We invite Jusara Korngold to walk us through this special moment. Jusara Korngold holds a Bachelor of Science and Master's in Business. She is the founder and president of the Spiritus Alliance for Books, a nonprofit organization which has the aim to promote and disseminate Spiritism in English, as codifi codified by Alan Kardec. Jusara is also one of the founders and directors of the Spiritist Group of New York, located in New York City. Jusara is also a Spiritist writer and has been translating Spiritist materials and books since 1993. In addition, she is currently the Vice President of the United States Spiritist Council, one of the Executive Directors of the International Spiritist Council, and also has been one of the Directors of the Tri-State Spiritist Federation. Josara has been working as a volunteer in the Office of Brazil Child Health in New York City since its opening in 2000 as its main executive. So let us use the tools that we have just learned. Awareness of the feet, length of the spine, awareness of the breath, and especially awareness of the heart. Uniting our minds and our hearts first to express our gratitude for the blessing moments, the blessing hours we have spent together enlightening our souls. As we come to the ending of this symposium, our thought is also one of gratitude to the Master of Leon, Professor Rivail, our dear Alan Kardec. Our studies today were focused on the gospel according to Spiritism. They're celebrating its 150th anniversary. The spirits come to teach us to pray, to show us the importance of connecting with our brothers and sisters that dwell in higher realms. Us here on earth is still understand the needs that we have, the imperfections of our soul. The illnesses that we bring in our physical bodies and the so many passions that deviate us from righteousness. And we pray for the one that is the healer of all souls, that is love once that lived among us. And we visualize the love and light of our brother Jesus. Our hearts 
you a mix of beating faster, of stopping, upon anticipating the presence of this great love that is still unknown on earth. And we feel like children that in confidence run to our parents and this time we run to this master to this teacher that taught us that love is capable of covering a multitude of sins only great love divine love can heal us and in humbleness we ask for this master and the divine spirits the benefactors that are here that we can feel their presence that we can be assisted by them in our needs in our emotions that they can help us to overcome our imperfections that they can help us to understand the benefits of forgiveness and love one another We are so blessed because in this lifetime we are already seeking for a spiritual awareness even though we understand our limitations and the pathway ahead of us let us not be afraid to walk in this path of light. Let us feel the embrace and the welcome that comes from the voices that have preceded us in this journey. Oh, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Creator, we ask for your mercy. We understand that life on earth can be so difficult at times, but we know that it's in this blessed school that we are going to be shaping our souls, that we are going to be reading ourselves from the layers that is still hold us in this path that we are just trying to emerge from of shadows and darkness. Let us visualize this light that is ahead of us. Feel the embrace of the good spirits soothing our minds, consoling our hearts, drying our tears, following their footsteps let us be courageous let us be determined and continue our journey towards the light ourselves when we bring love and forgiveness to ourselves. 
when I spread love and forgiveness to the world. Let us not forget that we are children of God and that we are loved by an unconditional love that follow us in each step of the way. We once more show our gratitude for all those that have come here, incarnates and discarnates alike, for family members, friends, spiritual guides, companions of so many eras, to our friend and collaborator in the spiritist field, Deborah. We thank you for being here with us. We thank you for your kindness and your love and for seeing once more your smile among us. Life goes on and on and it's beautiful and it's forever. 